Restoration Act is a step back. Where are you going? Devastating blow against basic human rights. Put your dick away Social first. Justice warriors fail to see the bigger picture. The AUG incident threw everything off the rails. Did you bring anything to drink? You bust into a man's home, you should at least bring a drink. Are you Johnny Gunn? That's right. What do you want? Have you heard about your wife? Which one? Excuse me? I've been married a bunch of times. Which wife are we talking about? Angela's dead. I'm sorry to be the one to tell you. They found her body in an alley. Yeah, well, you're not the one to tell me, so... I appreciate your way of trying to break it to me, though. Do you know if she died quick or not? No, I don't. I hope so. Angie didn't deserve to suffer. So you did know already? Your detective friend called, told me to sit tight and wait for you, so here I am, sitting tight, being cooperative. You don't seem too broken up about Angela's death. She was your wife, wasn't she? Ex-wife. We were divorced. Is that supposed to explain why you don't care? People die. Whether or not I care is between me and my memories of them. It's got nothing to do with you. What went wrong with your marriage? If you got divorced, then obviously something did. What are you, five? Adults get sick of each other. The ones that don't are just pretending. Lock any two people in a room, and they'll learn to hate each other sooner or later. It's the most natural thing in the world. I'm actually surprised. Angie held out as long as she did. You know, people say I'm not very easy to like. You don't say. So Angela left you, and you resented her for it. Resented her? <laughs> no. That's not who my resentment is directed toward right now. You resent me? Because I'm trying to figure out who killed her? Because you're treating me like a suspect. Because you're acting like you care more about her than I do. And mostly because you're the first human being to walk into my apartment and talk to me in almost a year. A year! And this is what we're talking about. I resent the situation. Anything else come to mind about Angela? At night. Her hair used to get in my nose and make it itchy. It was annoying, but nice. It made me feel human. Where were you tonight? I was out killing Angie. Doing whatever it is they did to her. That's what you think, isn't it? I'm not accusing you of anything. I just want to know what happened. Why? If anyone should want to track down the person who killed her, it should be me. But I choose not to. Case closed. You don't care if her killer is caught or not? No, I don't. I don't get off on vengeance. I say, let the bastard stir in his own damn guilt. Men who kill? I think they do it to get attention. They want to be caught. They want society to spank them just like their daddies did. Now, the real punishment for something like this is living with what you've done. That's not how it works. Why not? For one, finding this killer will ensure they can't do it again. Two, society has a right to protect itself. And three, where were you tonight? In my apartment. Alone. No one but the cockroaches can confirm or deny shit. Convenient, right? You sure you didn't go anywhere tonight? I went to the bathroom. Twice. Is that a bell tower patch on your jacket? Yeah. So? Let's just say I'm familiar with bell tower. What does that mean? Familiar how? It doesn't mean anything. It's just that I dealt with the company a while back, that's all. Really? You know, you look familiar. We didn't work together, did we? Did you know Giradelli 
Or maybe Powell? No, I doubt I knew them personally. That's too bad. We were all in New South Wales together. I thought maybe you... <laughs> Never mind. And they're all doing fine now. Relatively. Australia. You were there during the Civil War? That's right. And that was only the beginning. Not my first choice, believe me, but... Uh, Bell Tower wasn't all that big on choice. Send you where they want, make you do what they want, replace parts of you whenever and however they want. I didn't choose to be augmented either. Not when it first happened. Apparently we're supposed to be grateful. Alloy is so much better than skin, right? At least, that's how they sold it to me. For some things it is. Not for everything. I can walk through fire, but sand won't stick between my toes. I can shove a knife through my hand, but I can't trust what I feel. Even my dreams are made of alloy. Both of your hands are made of alloy? Fingers are for human beings, Mr. Gunn. What you have is so much greater. <laughs> and then they told me what they want me to do, and what would happen to me if I didn't. Well, let me tell you something. That's not me anymore. Hasn't been for a very long time. They found a partial print on Angela's neck. Belongs to whoever strangled her. My hands were designed to kill in wars no one's ever heard of. I couldn't leave a trace on someone's skin, even if I wanted to. They did it so you can kill better. So I'd never get caught. Ironic, right? Being a good killer is probably what saves me here. Or, you still think I killed Angela? I'm sorry for what Bell Tower did to you. Don't be. They gave me tools they wanted me to have. That it was in their interest for me to have. But the decision to use them... That was all me. Now, if you don't mind, I'd very much like to be left alone. Thank you, Dr. Christensen, for your honest and insightful perspective. This is Eliza Cassell, reporting to you. Tomorrow. If there is a tomorrow. 99 bottles of beer on the wall, 99 bottles of beer. Um, right. Hello? Just keep your eyes open. Užíváte si vyhlídku? Nemůžu uvěřit, že trčíme tak. Nejradši by nás roztrhali na kusy. No one is crazy enough to attack us. Aspoň 
aspoň že netrčím u skříněk s důkazama. Tohle jsem nasrál, že bych se bál tohle tušit. Očekává se, že na seznam poboček přibude Ostrava, Olomouc, Zlín a Kladno. Hezký město, že jo? Tohle jsem nasrál, že bych se bál tohle tušit. somewhere. By the way, I told Daria to go home. I really don't think she saw anything. I think I'm finally ready to shed some light on Angela Gunn's murder. That's good news. My bosses are eager to know why I haven't arrested Johnny yet. The truth is, we're not even close. Not yet. Why do you say that? What about Johnny? The more I think about all this, the more I can't shake the feeling. Johnny Gunn killed his wife. This was the work of a harvester copycat. This isn't some domestic dispute gone horribly wrong. It's part of something bigger. Someone's out there pretending to be a dead serial killer. I see you looked into that old case I pointed you toward. The M.O. is a perfect match. I read the notes and I compared them to this murder. The two victims were killed by the same person. I'm sure of it. All right. Let's say that's true. That doesn't necessarily exclude Johnny. It just means he's killed more than one person. Look, I'm just telling you what I found. For a while, I thought it might be Radko Perry. That maybe he was behind all of this. But that wasn't right either. What makes you so sure? I pretended to be Radko during a text messaging conversation. Turns out he rented himself a couple of augmented girlfriends the night of the murder. He was with them the whole time. They got video that proves it, and they're using it to blackmail him. Uh, the less I know about Radko's personal life, the better. What I meant was, what makes you so sure it can't be Johnny? Remember that partial print I found on the victim's throat? What about it? Johnny Gunn hasn't had fingerprints since the Australian Civil War. His hands are made of alloy. If he had strangled her, he wouldn't have left a smudge. 
alloy, huh? Shit. So, where does that leave us exactly? We followed the evidence we had. This is where it led us. You mean nowhere? I'm not sure exactly. I think a lot of the pieces are there. They're just not ready to be put together. Not yet. All right. That should be enough for me to get the rope off Johnny's neck. But it doesn't help me solve anything, does it? I mean, unless we learn more, there's no one I can drag in for this. Let's just hope learning more doesn't mean having to meet over another dead body. Hey, rookie! Get over here! Interpol. It's time to wrap this up. Are. All right. Let's call it a night. Get someone to pick her up. What do we do about Johnny Gunn? Forget him for now. Forget everything. Sir? I have no idea who did this and neither do you. That may scare the shit out of me. And it may piss some people off. But it's the truth. Yes, sir. And would someone... Daria, are you there? Is that you, neighbor? Are you checking up on me? It's very sweet. Are there any leads? I don't know who killed Angela Gunn, but I do know it wasn't an isolated case. Is that supposed to make me feel better? No, but it's the truth. Just try to be careful. Keep a low profile. If anything happens, if you ever think you're in danger, you know how to reach me. Thank you, but let's hope it doesn't come to that.